The Santa Suit is a pretty interesting film. This was released in 2010. It's directed by Robert Vaughan and written by Kevin Cummins. And it stars Kevin Sorbo as Drake Hunter. And Drake is the CEO of a toy company. And the business used to belong to his father. And when his father ran it, it was a great place to work. His father knew the value of toys, but also knew the value of spending time with loved ones, the spirit of Christmas, and of course, not being greedy. Kevin, however, didn't quite inherit those qualities and it's all about the money for him. And he's lost sight of the business that his father ran. And he has an encounter with a a Santa Claus, who we assume, uh, to begin with, is going to be a mall Santa Claus. He actually puts a spell on Kevin to teach him the error of his ways. Uh, This is at the beginning of the film, of course, and Kevin doesn't realise what's happened because Kevin still looks and feels like Kevin to himself, but to everybody else, he looks like Santa Claus. And he ends up getting a job. I say ends up, again, it's the beginning of the film. He gets a job as a, a Santa Claus in this shop and he has to spend time with the children and... Obviously, as the film progresses, he begins to realise what the season is all about and that he has been greedy. But whether or not that message truly sinks in, I'm I'm not going to say. But I I really enjoyed it. I found it to be quite interesting. There is something that I wish they'd done to make it more powerful. But I'll discuss that with a spoiler warning in a moment because I don't want to tell you what they haven't done in case it's something you also expect to happen. But I found it to be really moving and very creatively done. I think Kevin as a character is very well written, very well developed, and the pacing of the narrative and of his personal development, I thought all worked really well. Obviously, with this focusing on Santa Claus, there is a decent amount of Christmas in it, but there's also a decent amount of corporate greed as well, which is, of course, the point of the film. And I think it it did a really good job. It gets a little bit repetitive at times, I'll be honest. There's only so much you can do inside this small shop But we did go to other locations, of course. It's not just that one place, but we do spend a lot of time there because this is his job and it's where he works. And it did get a bit repetitive, but not so much that it affected my overall enjoyment. It's just there were times when I thought things were maybe slowing down too much for my liking. That aside, I think it worked really well. It's a very creative concept and it's rather well executed. The performances. Across the board, we're all fine. I think Kevin Sorbo did a great job with Drake um, or Santa Claus. And it's definitely one that I was happy to have seen. Would I watch it again? Probably not. It's not one that's going to become an annual tradition for me. But I absolutely didn't mind watching it. It's certainly not a bad film and I do recommend it. So a tiny spoiler for something that I wish they'd done. It's not really a bad thing that they didn't do this. I just think, well, it was something I was expecting to happen. For the most part, we don't see Drake wearing the Santa suit. We usually only see it when he's looking in the mirror or when he sees his own reflection in something. And I wish that as the film developed and his heart started to open up a bit and he started to realise the error of his ways, I wish we could start to see the Santa suit on him. And I don't know if I'd prefer if it was gradual, for example, we just see him wearing the trousers or just the hat, or if it was just a a kind of sudden realisation and he was wearing it. But I think that visual representation of his internal transformation would have been really powerful. And I think it would have been a really good thing for them to do, especially considering the film is called The Santa Suit and it's all about The Santa Suit. So I was kind of surprised that that's not the direction they took. But as I said, it's not so much a bad thing that they didn't do that. I just think it would have been more impressive, more powerful, and visually more engaging. But that aside, The Santa Suit is definitely a good film. I quite enjoyed watching it, and I definitely recommend it.